minor injuries. So we have rescued all the 20 crew from the ship Jindal Kamakshi. And uh, now uh, we hope to monitor the vessel which is there. Abhi wahi pe anchor is pe hai. Unko hum monitor kare. Thank you very much. So this is the ship that was rescued, uh, uh, 20 sailors of the ship were rescued on, on the high seas and this was a dramatic air rescue of the entire crew of a cargo ship that was sinking off the Mumbai coast. Coast Guard has rescued 20 personnel from this merchant vessel. It sent out a distress signal late last night, close to midnight. Uh, Jindal Kamakshi is in serious danger of sinking. The ship had yesterday around midnight sent out a distress signal. As for the latest information, bad weather, efforts to contain the situation have so far not succeeded. The ship is listing precariously. And those are pictures of that ship. 20 sailors, the Indian Navy and Coast Guard mounted an operation uh, to rescue people from this ship. Around midnight, it sent out a distress signal. The latest that we are getting from this is that 19 crew members had were rescued by a seeking 42 C of the Indian Navy. Uh, the seeking uh, arrived at uh, you know the Shikara Naval Air Station at Kolaba around nine this morning. Also, those who were rescued, uh, the master, of course, of the ship remained on board. Uh, for some more time and these are pictures of the dramatic rescue operation taking place. They were winched up on the Sea King helicopter and brought back on the coast. Now the weather in this area, as you can make out even from these pictures, it's raining. The seas are extremely rough. Visibility is down to less than one nautical mile and despite that, this rescue operation was mounted because that ship was sinking my colleague mustafa sheikh sends us this report basically it, it was a very dramatic scene they had to shift the containers on the vessel to balance the ship because the ship was listing towards one side and there were three navy helicopters which were sent this morning which rescued around 19 people from on board they have gone through medical checkups and now they are here uh, the basically this ship was going from gujarat to cochin when this incident took place and there, there is also said that the vessel had around 480 480 containers which is a very heavy amount for a vessel to contain currently we have with us the captain of the ship yeah. sir so what happened last night sir? how difficult it was to rescue her carry out a rescue sir rescue uh, the vessel and how to how did you control it for the last night see uh, initially vessel started pitching heavily and there were jerking noises so i told that this thing uh, i ordered immediately told chief engineer reduce the rpms and he reduced the RPMs. Once he reduced the RPMs, I saw this thing, vessel is not behaving well. So immediately I went on the bridge. I was in the cabin this time. It, because uh, while passing, I always, you know, go on the bridge and, you know, I, I was supposed to have gone at this thing 2 o'clock at night. But this thing happened suddenly and then I went up there. And then, it, it yeah. It was a whole night, it was a whole night, like from 2, uh, 12 midnight to this morning. How did you from, manage? I am used to, I can keep. Two days continuously, day and night, I can keep awake. Nothing will happen to me. So I'm, I'm so. So it was a very tough operation carried out by Indian Navy at the end of the day because very choppy waters. So the captain of the ship, they're talking about the problems that the ship was facing. Uh, from what sources in the Indian Navy have told India today, that uh, the ship was pitching and rolling in the high seas. Uh, there was trouble in the engine and that is where the captain of the ship sent out an SOS. He sent out a distress signal, uh, save our souls. And that's the time that the Indian Navy asked them to wait for first light while a Navy ship was also launched uh, uh, to rescue people on seas. This was very, very high seas. At first light, the seeking helicopter went up and it started winching people. 19 people were safely winched up and brought back safely.